we're so glad that you can join us today. In today's video, somebody will be getting his annual shots. And my video message today is to encourage you to make sure that you always get your kitty his their shots, his or her shots, and that you stay on top of that. There are diseases that kitties can get, such as feline leukemia, that and even rabies, that the shots can be preventative to help them not catch that. And it, particularly anybody who's got multiple cat households, it's very important for your kitty to have the shots that they need. In his case, I'm just doing it as a precaution. But they need their shots every year. And so today is going to be Kitty Shots Day. The veterinary clinic that I'm a member of, a part of, has a very nice Saturday vaccine clinic that they do every Oh, pretty much every week from what I've gathered. And we're going to go to one of those. It's going to be a little bit tricky. This is the carrying case that I have for him. And I am definitely a little bit worried that he won't fit too well into here. But I'm going to try and do the best I can. And then I will keep updating you as we go along this process. But this is a really neat one because it's got a little backpack that goes, um, that this is. I have a different old carrying case that I absolutely can't stand so I'm just going to try this and see how it works today. I'm not affiliated by this or you know by these guys or anybody that I'm not sponsored but I just wanted to let you know that these do exist. I found mine over Amazon. So now I'm going to get the kitty in and we'll see how this goes. Hello again everyone. So this is him in the carrying case. He's not super happy in here, but we're going to do the best we can. Oh, <laughs> you can see how the kitty fits through this video. And if any of you are thinking about buying one of these, I really recommend buying one that's heavier or that's a little bit bigger than your kitty is in weight. This particular one was for a 3 to 11 pound. You can tell that he fits. Well, he's relatively comfortable. I think it'll be good enough for going to the vet today. So... Let's move forward with this and see how it goes. This is the kitty. I have this on me. And I'm going to be taking him out to the car. So I will carefully be recording through this process. And we will see how this goes. So far he's really calm. And he's doing just fine. We will see how this goes. So far no meowing. No upset. He behaved very... That's me opening the front door. He behaved very differently when I had the cage, the carrying cage last year. This one, he's up right next to the mommy. And he's right up next to me. And I think that this is helping already. I'm amazed at how much he's not meowing. He's a little bit, yeah, he's a little worried now. Huh? I'm sorry, now some meows are starting because I'm outside with him. And I'm going to take this off of me very carefully. Okay. There we go. Yes. Here's my steering wheel. Here he is. Yes, he knows that something's up. Yes, this is out of the ordinary for him. It'll be okay, little guy. It'll be okay. It'll be alrighty. Kitty will be fine. Oh, ho, 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 ho. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. This won't take very long. Yeah. Yeah, kitties don't like being in cars, and he is no exception. Oh, he's upset. I have to get you your shots. That's my purse down there. I'm sorry, sweetheart. I know you're upset. Yes, we'll take the, We'll make this as fast as possible. And I will see you on the other side of this trip, everyone. Oh. As you all can see, it's holding up just fine. He's not happy in here. He's a bit scared. And he's upset, but he's okay. And this is holding up just fine. I was a little worried about that. Oh, little guy, I'm sorry. We'll go get you your shots, Ponto. Somebody isn't happy in here. 
I've done my best to help with this. Something that can help um, is if you have a carriage or a carrying case, if you have them spend time in this and regard it more like a second home, which I have been doing. I've been leaving this open for him to get into. I've left toys in here. But he's a very uh, disturbed because of the engine going, and he knows that something's going on. Alrighty, well, I'll see you guys in just a little while here. So here we are, ladies and gentlemen. I will show just that part. But here is the little guy just arrived here. He is not a very happy kitty right now. This is the most meowing I think I've ever heard from him in a whole year. So here I am in line with him. I will. So here I am in line with him. I will only show people's feet because I don't have permission. But he's officially in line here. Here's the wall. There we go. Yes, here he is. This is Nephi Cat getting his vaccines. Yes, he's got his annual boosters yeah, here yeah. to get taken care of. I appreciate you guys being here for him today. Of course. We're 13, 13 oh, today. Oh my! Well, that's why he still manages to fit in this pack then. <laughs> he was very yeah. upset through the, through the ride here, but he calmed down the second we got here. Oh, you're doing good. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Yeah. He's getting one on either hip. Thank you. you. Okay, there. I'll be careful about that. Okay. Oh, one more, yes, one more, and it's all taken care of. Okay. Yes. There we go. Just so nice one and more. fast. I really appreciate how fast this is. Thank you all so much. Back, you guys here. are wonderful. There Thank we go. you. Of course. You want to go back in? This is Myrtle Town a Veterinary oh. Clinic. And I may have to get him in if he's uncooperative. I'll get him. <laughs> They're wonderful. Oh yes, he says now that I'm out of there, <laughs> I can get him if it gets to be trouble. There we go. All right. Thank you, everyone. <laughs> Hi, everyone. Well, I did get the permission to record his shots, and so that'll be a part of this. And this, these are the shots that I got for him. Let's see that there's a feline respiratory three here. There's feline leukemia booster and rabies Purvax when you're feline. And so he's not due until this time next year. But anybody in our area, these, these guys are wonderful. A Myrtle Town Veterinary Hospital. They're absolutely wonderful. Yes, and somebody is upset because he has to migrate again. Yes, he hears the car engine. This actually did hold him okay. And as you saw in the prior um, little section, he's 13.3 pounds. So this is just big enough for him. Okay, we'll head ourselves back home. Even though it takes a little effort to get them to the vet, or to the vet it's very worth it. His safety and his protection is very worth it. So here we are. We've made it back safely. And it was wonderful that they actually let me record his shots. And for those of you who have little ones, love your kitties enough to take the time to get them vaccinated like they need to be. I know that it can seem like a little extra work, but it's worth the process and it's worth the effort so that you can make sure that they're safe. Just like we need to be safe as we, you know, and go to our doctors and so forth, they do too. This is my purse. I actually really like this purse. He just wanted to get out of this so much. A year ago, when he had his prior vaccinations, I wasn't doing YouTube videos yet. And I also didn't have this really nice carrying case. Even though they're a little bit tricky to work with, I like this so much more than the one that I had last year. That was one of this little clunky thing. It was very hard to open and close. And this has just been so much better. The technicians, as you saw, could open it up really easily and get him out. I'm just going to show you guys. This is a front porch of my house. There's where, there's where he stays. 
That's my room up there. <laughs> and somebody has done just fine. Yes, he has. Very impressed by the veterinary clinic. They were wonderful. I appreciate that a lot. Here's his little area. Still, yeah, there's the light that I usually use. And now we can take the kitty out. You know, thank you everybody for bearing with me as the light levels have changed. The sound quality may have changed. I really appreciate you guys. Look how this easy this is to open up. Yeah, look at this. I appreciate you guys sharing this time with us. They're all done. Somebody can come out now. Oh, how did you get out of your outfit? Oh, yes. Well, I'll take that off. That'll help. <laughs> Look at that little face. He says, let me out of here. Yes, he turned, managed to turn this all the way around. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, everybody, Nuffy. If you like the content of our videos, don't forget to take those paws and paw the like button. You can paw the notification bells and you can paw the subscribe button so that you can see all of Nippy Cat's videos. Well, thank you all so very much and we look forward to seeing you in the next video.